and a good evening and happy new year to you all. Mm -mm -mm. Can do your sip. <coughs> mm -mm -mm. Oh shit. That's what I get for putting in a minute of silence at the beginning. Alright, control is working. Uh, so, I'll talk more once this cutscene's over. This game kind of just jumps right into it. So, thanks to me and Mega Man, the ambitions of the World 3 were shattered. Life was peaceful again one month later. Ah! Alright, um, so I just kind of jumped right into this. Uh, let me adjust the sound a bit. Make sure I sound good too on stream. I can't tell from that because it's too loud. Give me one second. Talking, talking, gotta build up a buffer here. One sec. That sounds fine. Maybe a little loud on the game end. Okay, so, um, what am I doing? Well, I didn't stream yesterday. I, I had to go to bed early. I was tired, too. And, um, on New Year's, I streamed the Animal Crossing thing. I decided that I was at a pivotal point in Golden Sun Dark Dawn, and it wasn't worth finishing this, because I wouldn't finish it this weekend. Even if I streamed it as much as possible now and even tomorrow, I probably still wouldn't be done. So I decided, uh, I'll take a break, wait until after I come back from my, my short hiatus to stream it. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to stream uh, another game that I had planned, Mega Man Network Transmission, which is a Battle Network game. It's a different Battle Network game, as you can see, because it's on a console and it's in 3D. Um, Storyline-wise, this takes place between 1 and 2. This came out right before 3 did in America. And I figured this would be a good game to start the year, because this, this year is the 20th anniversary of Battle Network in general. And uh, I wanted to play this before I do, do 6 this uh, summer. Also... It works out well because I think this year on my streams I'm going to focus a lot more on games that I either haven't played yet or are just coming out. So I kind of want to get all the replays done early, which Golden Sun Dark Dawn is one of them. This is one of them. Uh, when Scott Pilgrim vs. The World comes out, that'll be another one that I'm technically replaying. And then uh, everything after that I have planned is either going to be a new game or a game that I haven't played yet that's on my backlog. Uh, and I, I, the clip button on my stream just flashed. I don't know what that was for. So yeah, it's, um, a lot of stuff, but, uh, the important thing is that tonight is the last stream before I go on my, uh, quick hiatus. Cool. Alright, speaking of, I actually just got an email regarding that. Uh, perfect. But yeah, I decided I wanted to start with this, something challenging, something to break up all the RPG stuff, because there's been a lot of it recently, so I figured something that's more pure action with minor RPG. Oh, shit. That's just a lot of Robo, isn't it? Well, crap. All right, whatever. Uh, let me just check my tags here real quick. Did I put voice acting in the tags? Yes, I did. Good. Because this is Battle Network, so you know, I gotta do that. Which, fun fact, I did not do voice acting for the first game when I streamed it. I only did it for the second game on. And I'm not that good at it. Also, I apologize for the large black border. There's really not a lot I could do about that. It's just kind of the limits of, um... <laughs> Dolphins, um, streaming capability, or 
visual capability. I could probably do something to fix it, but whatever. Anyway, I've stalled long enough here. Let's play the damn game. Oh, I'm not looking at the actual stream. I'm looking at the preview of the stream. I'm stream that's like 10 seconds behind. Too much time on your hands, Lan? Space question mark. You keep yawning. Maybe you're suffering from sleep deprivation. Nah, it's not sleep deprivation. I'm just bored lately. Yeah, isn't it great? No incidents to worry about. Peace rules. Yeah, I have no idea why the punctuation is parsed uh, a space after the words. It's almost as bad as Danganronpa's uh, eye, lowercase eyes being parsed all the way to the right. So that everything looks broken up whenever there's a lowercase i in a world word. Well, yeah. Well, yeah. Blech. Anyway, Lan, did you do today's homework? Ugh. Would no be a safe guess? Is it that obvious? Obvious? Not at all. Hey, if you're that bored, why don't you do it now? Takes you back to when you were living with your G parents. This takes me back to... The year I almost failed English class and people got pissy at me for it. I did not enjoy school. Alright then, time to launch the homework program. Ah! Wait, I've got some email. Why do you always change the subject when I mention your homework? Read this email? The Higsby's Chip Shop is holding a grand thank you sale, huh? Come check out our amazing selection of Navi Battle Chips, huh? We're in the building with an S in front of the ACDC school gates, huh? Mail news. Damaged by the new type of virus known as the Zero Virus is spreading. Me fail English, that's impossible. I failed it because I didn't do a large project that I was supposed to over the course of many months. I just didn't do it. So I got like a D in the class and I'm like, I don't fucking care. I really don't. And to be honest, I'm uh, uh, to be honest, nothing I learned in high school has stuck with me except Japanese 1. So there you go. And even that hasn't stuck that well. The Zero Virus infects navvies instead of electronic devices and adversely affects their functions. No effective vaccine is available yet, so the only possible response to an infection is to turn off your PET. Go outside. Play outside. Turn off the PET. I do find it ironic that I uh, that I did bad in an English class. In uh, to be fair, it was mostly. Well, no, I guess it was English. It was British literature. I find it funny that I almost failed that, and then I went on to be a communications major in college, and then did absolutely nothing with my communications degree. Higher education is bullshit, that's what I'm saying. This takes place between 2 and 3? No, it takes place between 1 and 2. And there's actually direct connections to 1 and 2. The opening cutscene is the end of 1. And also, the armor in this game is from 1. And they briefly touch upon the idea of, um... Of, uh, armor change, form changes at the end of the game. Also, I believe there's a direct connection in the epilogue, too. Yo, Lin, are you working on your antivirus strategies? I'm protected. Today, I'm gonna have Gutsman go buy the latest vaccine I pre-ordered on the net. Bet you're impressed. Yes, I'm very res I'm very impressed by your uh, responsibility in getting vaccinated. Lan, they say their own names. She said Meru Day. Len, have you been on the net lately? I sent Roll on an errand this morning, but I guess she got lost somewhere. She's really late. If you see Roll on the net, tell her to hurry home, please. So periods and question marks are parsed correctly, but exclamation points aren't. He didn't say his name. Oh wait, question mark is, is spaced out there. The translators weren't paying attention. <laughs> it's Dex. Wonder where Roll went. Can Navi's get lost? Wow, he really jumped around topics there. Not usually. I wonder what happened. We're like homing pigeons. We could see infrared lights on the internet. Ah, oh, well, Mega Man. Let's jack in and look for Roll. Good idea. I'm kind of worried about her. All right, an excuse to get out of doing homework. What are you grinning about, Lan? <laughs> anyway, to jack in, all you do is press Start Pause to open your PET and select Map. Then you select the place you want to jack into. And remember, Cyber Worlds are dangerous, so don't forget to save your game. So there's blocky ass land. Hunched over. That's a weird walk cycle. Why is he hunched over? Also, I like how there's just straight up Mazinger on his ball in this game. Uh, okay, so what do we got here? A, G, 
chips. Chips on Y. Jump with A. Buster with B. I'm using the Switch Pro Controller, so this layout's much more diamond-shaped than this. I will. It's a weird quirk of the GameCube controller that's so A-centric. Stand in the place where you are. So that switches Jump and Buster, but keeps Chips and Stand in the same. What does Stand do? What does that button mean? Do I want A to be the Buster and B to Jump? No. I want Jump on A and Buster on B. And Stand and Chips... You know what? I'll worry about this later. So items. Key items. Lance Handheld Terminal with Mega Man.exe installed inside. Mega Man Eguze. Which is celebrating its 20th anniversary this year. The whole series. Let's jack into the net from Lance House. So you just kind of get like a map in this game that you select. You don't walk around the real world. Look, don't look. Hey, uh-huh. What you want, huh? Uh, sub chips, chips. I have no money. You start with no money in this game. For a set time, you can't move or be attacked. So I have the Z, R, and Z, L button set to L and R, and then I have the R button set to Z, because it mimics how the GameCube controller is set up. And the energy replenishes a small amount of HP. So he is again, huh? This game, uh, is not easy. Folder, 20. So that's the first difference here. 20 chips instead of 10, uh, 30. And they work a little differently, because as you can see, there is a... Number to the right. 10 out of 10. 5 out of 5. Uh, I can set a standard chip. Oops. Okay, Z button sets. Uh, let's set... Let me set cannon to that. Yeah, obviously the chips and damage numbers in this game are going to be a little different than normal. Like V-Gun doing 50 instead of 30. Bomb... Swords are doing... Well, swords always do 80. Actually, these are pretty close to what they are in Battle Network 1. Which is funny, because this game came after 2. Came out after 2, and 2 nerfed all the chips. Uh, Sub-chips, we already know what those do. That does stuff outside of battle. Email, we've already read that. You could select Lance House. If you're, okay, so that just talks to Mega Man. That's the equivalent of pressing L. Library, again, just a library of chips. There's a lot less than normal, as you can see. Uh, there's no quick way to sort through them, though. That's interesting. Uh, you get the program advanced thing in this game. It's the first game to have that. Tech well, no, 2 has it. Jack out works only when you're jacked in, and it makes an annoying noise when you can't use it. Uh, where's Mega Man's stats? Upgrade this function. Uh, so here we go. Uh, HP and MP are shown up there. Obviously, MP is a new stat for Mega Man Battle Network. HP is lower than normal. You get the same three stats you can increase, like in 1 and 2. You get 1's armor si system, which doesn't change how you look, but gives you elemental stats. You technically have a level. And uh, backup are your lives. Which replenish every time you jack out. Uh, ignore that. Where's the... Wow, that's very confusing. The map is right there. Also, yeah, game has the anime voice actors, which at this point was Japan only. Actually, no, the anime came out here when this game did, but uh, they didn't use the double ones. I know that this was Needleman's debut. I think this is the only Battle Network Needleman is in. Jacked into the net complete. What's it like, Mega Man? Hmm. I think there are more viruses than there used to be. Even though the World 3 is gone? Yeah, we'll have to be careful, Lan. It's been a while since we busted viruses, so let's review how we did it, even though it's completely different now. Mega Man, I sent you chip data. First, you need to send me the chip data to deb something enemies, I don't know. You select the chip data to use in a stage from this screen, the custom screen. If the custom gauge at the top of the screen is full, you can call up the button with the Z button whenever you want. Screen with the Z button. 
The element and attack values of the chip with the cursor on the left side of this custom screen, and the number owned in MP, MB, are used on the right. Alright, let's try it. After you select all the chips, move the cursor to A and press the A button. So there's no chip codes in this. You can just kind of scroll through all of them. Uh, I set this to the basic chip, so it's always going to be set at the beginning. You can select as many of the- well, you can select up to five chips. Sending selected chips to Mega Man. Okay, now I can use the chips. Let's start off by trying the basic attack chip, Cannon. Select the chip with the L or R button and use the- and use it with the Use Chip button. Use the Standby button to stop the game and safely switch chips. That's what Stand means. Stand by in the place where you are. Now it's face north. Alright, switch the chip to Cannon and try hitting that Metor. Left, right. Jump. Maybe I want to switch that after all. <laughs> Alright, so B jumps, A shoots, sound effect is very underwhelming. L and R swaps between your chips. Um, X is standby mode, which pauses the game. And I believe Y is what shoots. There we go. There are two Metors up ahead. We can just use the cannon here, or for an easier fight, use the V-gun. Shots from the V-gun explode in a V-shaped blast after hitting. So if you hit the bottom Metor just right, you might be able to kill the Metor above it at an angle. Try it. Kill, not delete. Lynn, do you understand how to use chips? Don't worry about running out. The MPs that use chips will gradually come back over time, and the faster you defeat viruses, the more chips you'll get. This time you selected all five chips, but you can also leave some behind. When you're at full HPs, you can hold on to recovery as part of your strategy. Those are the basics. Let's go, Lan. So it's a side-scrolling battle network. Uh, the MP bar on the right determines how fast you can use chips. You can see how much MP it uses with, by how much uh, is grayed out at the top. That recovers automatically, but the chips you use here are used up for the rest of the trip online. So you see I only have nine cannons now and four V-guns. If I collect more from enemies, though, it will replenish the stat. So like it went back to ten because I grabbed a cannon. I do believe there is a max of each chip that you can have per, uh, per game. So, like, once you hit, like, 20 cannons, that's it. Any further cannons you get only re will, temporarily repl will temporarily replenish it during, uh, a mission, but it won't add one permanently to your count. Lynn, a security cube is blocking the path here. This wasn't here the last time we came this way. I wonder what's going on. We'll need a passcode to unlock it. What do you want to do, Lynn? We're locked in, so we'll have to find a passcode. You're right. Okay, let's go to the left first. We'll need a level 1 code to get past the security. Oh yeah, you can slide in this game too. Oh fuck, I used a cannon. Alright, that's gonna be weird. Uh, cause I can't switch chip and... and buster. As you can see, buster, not exactly strong in this game. You can make it strong though. Analyzing mystery data. Contain the data for level 1 code. Len, this passcode. Ah, oh, this must be the passcode for that security cube we just passed. Let's go back and try it. Alright. I use the cannons to destroy the cannons. Something me and my me and my brother always notice that the character models in this game are very blocky, and I think that's because of uh, Arika. Ar I think Arika did the models for this game. But looking at it now, Mega Man's isn't too bad. I know Rolls looks kind of weird. And yeah, just like classic Mega Man, enemies regenerate very quickly. The second they leave the screen, they're pretty much back. Mega Man, can we use the passcode we just found? Hang on, I'll analyze it. Yeah, looks like we could use this passcode. We did it! Now we can go forward! Alright, let's open the security cube with a level 1 code. I keep wanting to hit select to see what that does, and I keep forgetting the GameCube controller does not have a select function. 
Give me one second, too. I have to check something real quick. Nice. Alright. Sorry, just want to make sure everything's okay here. Yep. Okay, looks good. Okay, note to self, button, hand off the Y button. Jumping is, uh, the hitbox is a little delayed, as you saw there. The corridor is getting more narrow here. Best to slide here. Hold the control stick pad down and jump to slide. Oh, wait, I could use... Oh, yeah, I didn't notice that. I could use the stick or the, uh, pad. Okay, can't jump up ladders. This isn't, uh, this ain't... This ain't your daddy's classic Mega Man. I really wish I could map shoot to Y. I mean, I could. I could switch the controls on the GameCube. But that's gonna mess up everything else. Mama B and anime game. Yep. <laughs> HP memory. Also, I don't know why I said it like that. I know. I, I knew. <laughs> yeah, it is the anime game. Te technically canon anime game. Battle Network 6, uh, full version, does reference this game. Wait, Mega Man, there are lots of viruses up ahead. Yeah, we'll take damage. Let's go over by using the cyber bar. Jump and hold the control pad up. Jump one more time while holding the cyber bar to drop down again. Whoa, that is a lot of viruses. I need to take them. So, hey, Mushy, how you doing? Oh, oh, yep, yep, but maybe not. Doing well? That's cool. Nice land. Looks like you got your virus-busting sense back. Run from everything. But don't overdo it. Jack out before you lose your last backup. Open the start pause... Oh, open the PET with start pause and select jack out. You can jack out anytime I'm standing on the floor. Alright, it's time for the real thing. Be careful. Yeah, no problem. As you can see, it's not too uh, noisy in here, so I generally have time to talk to everyone. Land, are you paying attention to the panels on the floor? The blocks with panels indicate the correct route. Blocks without panels are incorrect routes from a programming standpoint. Let me travel back real quick. Nice thing is that the load times are low once you actually get in the area. Zenny's. Whoa, oh no, how did that thing get up here? Met there too. Mega Man, I sent you chip data. Uh, let's put Recov 10 in the wings here. Sword, Radon is good. Yeah, well, might as well. I forget how you get more down here. Did you just unlock that, or is there a way? There's no way to sacrifice chips in this game. I shouldn't have put Recov first. That, you need a hard hitter attack to break open. This game's interesting too, because it's got some chips from 2 in it as well. Oh shoot! Forgot to grab the thing. Ow. This game definitely skews more towards, um... Game definitely skews more towards being difficult with single enemies 
as opposed to piling on a bunch in a, in a room like regular classic Mega Man sometimes does. And there is technically a busting rank in this game. It's very interesting. Like, the game won't tell you how well you defeated an enemy, but the faster you defeat an enemy once it appears on screen, the less damage you take, uh, the better rewards you'll get. There, I, I don't know how it works exactly, but there is some sort of ranking to it. We'll need a level 2 security code to get past this. One is my stint at AGDQ uh, next Friday. Friday morning from 5 a.m. till 7.30 a.m. And that's assuming that I don't get uh, at called in to do any backup hosting before then. I don't think I will because this is my first time doing this, so I'm going to only be like that one block of four games. If you check the website's schedule, it'll give you the most up-to-date times. Land, there's a spike trap up ahead. If you touch a spike, you'll take enough damage to be deleted. Be careful and never touch the spikes. I mean, I don't need to take a break the entire time because it's not even during a point where I stream, but I also feel weird streaming during the event while the event is also using the same service. And uh, also, I could just use a week where I'm not streaming and I don't have to worry about it to get other stuff done, especially since I'm taking two days off for this uh, charity block. So, you know, two hours of work and then I'm treating myself to two days off that I could get other stuff done and then enjoy myself. Len, look, there's a backup chip here. Get backup chips to automatically increase the number of backups. Each backup you have lets you get deleted at least once without losing the game. You could come back to life. Let's get it now. Why is he talking like it's Land that's getting these and not himself? So I believe you start with one already. Yeah, backup two of two. So essentially I have three lives now. And they replenish every time you jack out. I have recovered 30, I'll be fine. I could add that in later. I generally don't use Stone Body, that's only really useful in like boss fights. That was a waste of me to blow that cannon. Ugh. Oh, come on! That miss. Kind of hung up there. Roll! Hey there, Mega. Where have you been? Where have you been? Mail was worried about you. I know. I need your help, Mega. There's a fire up ahead. A fire? In Cyberworld? I came here to get away from the fire, but the fire is blocking my way home. So I've been looking for another place to jack out from. You can just go back to my house. The security has us locked up here. But a fire? You don't see that every day. Mega Man, let's go check it out a little. A little? Okay. Yeah. If you're gonna go in, you'll need this heat armor. If you equip it, it'll reduce fire element damage by half. Thanks, Roll. I think that doubles the amount of damage you take from, uh... Water, though. Yeah. 
So yeah, you're just handed the first armor. I think you're handed all the armor in this game. And it counts as it counts as plus three levels, just like in uh, Battle Network One. Heat armor. Can't save in Cyber World. Okay. One of the best songs in the game right here already. Oh, wow. This is horrible. What a huge fire. Huh? What's wrong, Mega Man? There, Lance. See that guy over there? Fireman? He was a World 3 Navi. He started the fire. But the World 3 doesn't exist anymore. Flames of Justice burn twice as bright and half as long. Not incorrect. Either way, if it's Fireman, we can't just let it slide. Let's go, Mega Man. Yeah, time to stop Fireman. He must be up ahead. So an interesting thing in this game is uh, strategic dying, which I'm not going to do now, but when you die, uh, you get all of your chips. Current chips will go back to the folder. So if you choose yes, you could redo your folder, but then you have to uh, wait for the bar to fill up again. Uh, and then you don't have the chips anymore on hand until they come up. That said, um, if you die, I believe you get all your chips back. Like, all your uses of it replenish, as well as your entire MP bar. So if you're in a situation where it's just easier to die and come back, uh, it's sometimes better to do that. Like, I probably won't try to beat Fireman uh, on this life. Or I will, but I'll just replenish and, and die and come back. Kind of like getting a game over in Mega Man when you're at the Wily Castle and it refills um, refills all of your weapon energy. I call it strategically game overing. You can come back to this area, but it's not like see how there's like a ladder going down. Yeah, under there. That's the way to Mail's PC. It's just like Roll said. There's no way through there. We'd better stop Fireman fast before the damage spreads any further. So you do get to come back to this area normally later. In fact, you have to, but, uh... You can't do this net on fire part again. Like that mystery data up there you can't get now. I think. Do I have a chip that might let me get that? I really hate the way they organize the menu in this game. It's not like the other games, so it's very hard to remember where the options are. Also, there's no quick way to scroll through these. Lack of charge shot annoys you. Uh, it is in the game. I just don't have it yet. Burner? No, burner doesn't make me dash. Wait, maybe dash attack would, though. Hold on. Dashing attack in the direction you're facing. Oh shit! Didn't even do that. God damn it. Oh no, you don't refill your cannon uses. Never mind. Alright, so chip usage doesn't refill when you die. So wait, what's the point of dying? Strategic air shoes give you a double jump. Yeah, but there's other ways to get over there too. Now I can't remember what uh, the point of dying strategically was, because if it just refills your health, kind of pointless. in the air. That doesn't go very far. Never mind. 
So repair is an interesting chip in this game. Uh, it's used to make certain platforms appear, but only in specific spots. It's needed to get to a very, very secret thing at the end of the game. Lighting effect here is pretty nice. Air shoes do give you double jump, though. This is a neat translation of them in this game. Like, okay, well, panel broken panels don't exist anymore. What do we do with air shoes? Double jump. I believe you need, like, five or six double jump chips to actually find everything in the game, too. This is a point where you need to just, like, jump a whole bunch in the air. Mega Man, I can sense a powerful virus down below. It must be fire element. It must be a fire element virus from, that was energized by the fire. Be careful. Okay, let's equip that heat armor Roll gave us. To equip armor, select armor from Mega Man in the PET menu, and that's it. Oh, it's a spiky. Oh, look at this, it can't hit me from here. That's beautiful. Mega Man, the floor up ahead was weakened by the fire. You can run over it, but if you slow, you'll fall into the fire. If you go too slow, excuse me. Got it, but even if the floor falls away, if you use repair, you can put it back to the way it was before. So be ready to do that. Oh, jeez, fire bats. Fuck. Enough fire bats. Land. There he is. I can sense him over there. Ah, it's been so long since our last net battle. Are you ready, Mega Man? Mega Man, are you ready for the battle? Okay, now I'm ready. <laughs> burn, burn! Stop, Fireman. Hmm? Who do you think you are getting in my way? What are you doing? You're working for the World 3 again? The World 3? <laughs> no, this has nothing to do with them. I like burning things, that's all. <laughs> you. This jerk won't listen to reason. <laughs> now it's your turn to burn. He's coming. Mega Man. Battle routine. Set. Execute. Fuck. 
First time I've beaten him on the first shot. <laughs> that fire hurts like hell, and you have to- it's a very tight dodge window for sliding under it. If you're even, like, a, like a couple frames too late, you're gonna get hit by the end. We did it! Yeah, at least that will stop the damage from spreading anymore. Now all we have to do is leave it to the center to put out the fire. Ah, my firemen. Match, what are you thinking? How could you? I didn't do a thing. Fireman went crazy and did this all by himself. I can't believe that. I'm serious. I've been looking for him all this time. Check the records. Mega Man, what do you think? Yeah, there's no record of anyone operating Fireman. How do you know that? But what if he just entered the orders previously for Fireman to carry out? Look at that. If that was true, I wouldn't come strolling around like this. But I gave him a vaccine before the Zero Virus could get him. Huh? Lynn, I think we should tell your dad about this. If he examines the data from Fireman's remains, he might find something. Yeah, that'll prove my innocence, too. Heh. <laughs> okay, well, there's no point in just arguing here. Alright, let's get that data and jack out, Mega Man. Okay, got it. I got a little Fireman figure in my room. Right! Hmm, that's strange. Dang that Match, I bet he's hiding something, I can tell. No, it's not Mr. Match. Huh? It's that vaccine Mr. Match installed in Fireman. Why? Isn't a vaccine something like a medicine? Yeah, I don't know if you're ready to learn about this yet, but... Vaccines, viruses, navvies, and chip data are all pro And chip data? And chip data are all programs. So they can be all used for good and bad things. So there are good viruses too? <laughs> well, I don't know about that, but a bad vaccine is conceivable. Ah, oh, that's right. Len, it was in today's mail news. The Zero Virus vaccine is still missing. Huh? Oh yeah. So that vaccine Match used was a bad one. Well, we can't be sure yet. We'll investigate this at Sky... At the sc almost at Skylab. That's what I say as a joke when I'm mis purposely mispronouncing things. We'll investigate this at the Skylab. I won't be able to go home for some time until this is solved. Stay put, Lan. I will. Don't work too hard, Dad. Why does it look like he's playing with this PET? It looks like he's playing a game. Alright, Mega Man, let's go. What? I thought you were gonna stay put. Are you kidding? Do you want my dad to have to work all night? If we could find the guy who's spreading the bad vaccine, he'll be happy. Yeah, I bet you just don't want your mom to get angry again. Thought so. Ah, oh, well, you're right anyway. We gotta do something. Didn't I just say that? Okay, it's settled. With the fire out, we can explore more. Man, you've got email. I'll just pace around the room for a bit while I read it. Roll came home. Roll just came home. You found her for me, didn't you, Lan? Thanks. I attached Roll's Navi chip to this email to show my appreciation. Be sure to move it from your pack to your chip folder. You won't be able to use it. One more thing, you could use my PC whenever you want. If you want to go deep into the net, my house is a convenient jack-in. Hello, official net battlers. This- Hello, young lady. <laughs> ah! This is the battle mailing list. Net battle simulators have been installed in various locations recently. You could use them to fight with any navy you fought in the past. Feel free to practice your virus busting and net battle techniques. Ah, it's been a while since we've gotten mail from the battle mailing list. Freud secretly registered us on that list during that last incident. Maybe we should cancel our subscription before they find out and get mad. Well, yeah, but those net battle simulators sound fun. Power up your navy. Today at Higsby's, we've received a shipment of types of all types of elemental armor, huh? Armor is the most standard types of defense programs that you must install, huh? These power up in all caps, items can be equipped from the PET's menu, Mega Man Command, huh? If you find one, don't forget to equip it, huh? There's no space between one and don't there, but there's a space between huh and the, the exclamation point. About default chips, special default chips. Do you remember how to set your default chips? Select your favorite chips on the folder screen, then press Z to make these chips your default chips, so that they are always available when you open the custom screen. You can only set chips that fit inside your Navi's default capacity. This setting is a very important strategy, important part of strategy. Don't forget it. So we got firearm. Oh, that's right, you don't get the navy chip right away. Flamethrower attack that pierces obstacles. So 
So Navi chips only have one use each, unfortunately. You can get more, I think, but it's not much. Maybe that is the Navi chip. Hold on. Nope, firearms up there. And it's only three stars. So that's not the Navi chip. There's gotta be a quicker way to scroll through this. Oh, there we go. Why wasn't that working before? Yeah. I believe I need all the Navi chips in order to get the secret at the end of the game. Head deep into the net and find the guy selling the bad vaccine? I don't know. Why? Why are you asking me? This is... Yeah, I got map. That's what I gotta remember. Go to the map for everything. Okay, so that's the battle simulator. Fireman data. You've defeated this Navi at a busting level of 9. Okay, so I need S on all of them. Let's see if I can maybe pull out a faster time here. Keep forgetting standby mode exists. He had what, 400 HP? That probably wasn't his chip, though. Nah, it was another firearm. But upside is, now I have two of them. Half energy, aqua armor, aqua armor, wood armor, lek armor. I can't buy any of those. Stone body, I already have one. Mini bomb, already have it. Bubbler, already have it. I don't have aqua sword yet. Really don't need them though. I'll save up for the armors. See us again, huh? Oh, I didn't save. Shit. Yeah, there's no auto-saving this game. No asking you if you want to go to bed. Hey, the fire is completely out, isn't it? Yes, this is the first time we came here. It was all on fire with no way down. Now we can use this link to the lower right of this area to go even further. Okay, let's go, Mega Man. We gotta find the guy with the bad vaccine. The dude with the tood. gonna just jack out. I want to save and also, um, I just want to save. It's very easy to die and there's no option to restart when you die. You just go to a game over screen, so I don't want to risk that happening. Also, game was a little annoying because even when you save over a file, you needed another spare file in order to make the data and then it would delete the old one. So... It was actually kind of weird. Like, you technically need two save slots to, to keep one file. Because it would constantly write... It writes a new save file, then deletes the old one. So you need the space for it. Also, my HP went up to uh, 100 at some point, And I don't know how. Did I get an HP memory?
Mega Man, I sent you chip data. All right, I'm gonna try something here. I'm gonna dismiss this. Well, no. I'm gonna pull the chips. I'm gonna wait a few seconds while this fills up, and then I wanna see what happens if I alter the chip folder. See, I do have 15 cannons now. There is a limit to how many you can have, though. That's not where the folder is. Let's put Zap Ring 1 in, in place of, uh, the Wrecker. Oh, okay, so it makes you lose your current chips, but the custom bar still fills up. Yep. So if you're at, if you if the bar is full, then you could ch switch chips freely without worrying about it. Because then you could just pull it back up. Yep. There may be some Zenny farming I do off stream, just just to make this a lot quicker. I also don't know if I'm going to go for the hidden like final part of the game. Just because, uh, it does require some grinding to get to. And the part itself is actually very short, so... Since the fire has died down, we could go from Den Area to Global Area. To get to the Link to Global Area from here, go down and to the right. The area above this ladder is in a horrible state from the fire. I'm gonna put 10 at the end. Wow, that recover 10 image is very crusty looking here. Oh, this is the area from before. That's why. I'm like, how do I get that? I just realized this is the area I tried dashing to and failed. But look, there's more space here now. So I probably could dash there if I, I get the chip. Also, just like in the main game, uh, blue mystery data are one-time items. Same with yellow, I believe. waste of two cannons there. Game's a little labyrinthian. Not gonna lie. It, it takes some getting used to knowing where to go in this game. Global Area 1. This is where I'm supposed to be. Yep. 
Those are spikes that will kill me if I hit it. Or I think it'll da it'll damage me at least. Fire Hurricane. Ooh, HP memory. Nice. No ice. Mem up. Thanks, I guess. sword. Nice, that's two long swords right there. That's a chip I already didn't have a lot of to begin with. Dex's PC up ahead. Since when did he have a security cube like that there? There have been lots of problems lately. It's probably his provider's. Provider? It's the company that connects a computer to the net. Like an operator. Ah, okay. In that case, Dex must have got the passcode to get this pass... Ugh. Uh, wow, I, I just had a stroke there. Ah, okay. In that case, Dex must have the passcode to get past the security. Yeah, but we don't have the passcode now, so let's look somewhere else. We need... Level 3 code. The link just above us goes to the outer net. You can get to Global Area 2 by going past that security cube to the left. Outer net. Outer heaven. So this is the outer net. Kind of a dark area. Yeah, it's pretty run down, but it's not a bad area, really. But that doesn't mean the center doesn't watch this area that closely. Oh, but that means the center doesn't watch this area that closely. That guy who's spreading the bad vaccine might be around here. Yep. 
I didn't see what that was. I think it was a V gun. down there. Nothing! There are bottomless pits in this game. Backup chip. Nice. Just what I needed. Ah, oh, but I can't get over there. Mega Man, there's a Navi there. Let's ask him if he knows something. Okay, excuse me, is there a place to buy the Zero Virus vaccine around here? Huh? You too? Yeah, that Zero Virus is pretty scary. I know how you feel. All it does is slow down your processes, but once you're infected, you can't get rid of it in the usual way. It's a pretty stubborn virus. No kidding! Lin, didn't, you didn't know anything about the Zero Virus, did you? <laughs> well, unfortunately, I, Starman, used to sell that vaccine. I just sold the last batch. I can get some more, though. Want some? Mega Man, this is the guy. Yeah, you're the one spreading the bad vaccine around. Huh? You can't fool us. Not even my dad can analyze the Zero Virus. Ah, so you figured me out. Ah, oh, well, I made a juicy profit already. I don't want the center on my back, so I'll see ya. And away I go. Did he jack out? Land, he didn't jack out. I could still sense him nearby. Woof. Ha! <laughs> You're one persistent Navi. You could fight this guy. If you aren't deleted, I'll see you later, maybe. <laughs> he was spreading a virus? That jerk. Alright, let's bust it. Or showing a chips here. Mega Man, what about Starman? Did he ever say his name? He ran this way. Let's go look. Hey, isn't that Number Man down there? Higsby's Navi? You're right. He has a net shop here, too. That's odd. Well, whatever. It's convenient for us. We can ask if he saw Starman. Welcome to Higsby's Net Shop. See anything you like? Number Man, there's something I want to ask you. Ah, uh, Mega Man. What's up? Why do you look so flustered? Did a gold-colored Navi just code through here? He's a real bad one. Gold-colored Navi? I've been here a while and I haven't seen him. Hmm. It's no good, Lan. We've lost him. Dang. Next time we find him, he won't get away so easily. Ah, oh, well. What do you want to do now? Tell your dad? Yeah, good idea. Hmm? Land, you have email. I've got a serious problem. Gutsman is acting crazy. He's on a rampage. I can't control him for my PET at all. Good thing he's still on my PC. I think he's planning to take his rampage to the net, though. We can't let that happen. Land, go to the net to my PC and stop him. I included a level 3 code with this email. You're the only one who could help me out. Really? What about that email Dex sent? He mentioned a vaccine. No doubt about it. He was talking about Starman's vaccine. 
Let's go, Lan. If we don't hurry, Gutsman will go crazy like Fireman. Okay, Mega Man. Let's go stop Gutsman inside Dex's PC. HP memory, memory up, power up. Uh, probably should just straight up buy that. Burns Fist. Mystical Fist of Power. Yeah, why not? Buy it. Buy it. HP memory's only 500 zenny. Buy it. Finally, we can uh, upgrade charge and actually get it. Charge 1 is bullshit because there's no actual level to it. Oops. Alright, so if you have a blue charge, releasing it does nothing. Security cube doing in a place like this? In this rundown old area, the outer net? This is a pretty tight security cube. What could it be protecting? Hmm. Makes me wonder, but we can't get past it, so let's go back. Level 5 security cube. We haven't even found level 4 yet. Perfect. Wow, that, that PET image right there was kind of fucked up. Go rapid. A little faster. Ultimately not worth it right now. It's worth pulling it up before I throw it into an enemy. That said, if I increase charge more, it will, uh... It will, uh, make it charge faster. These guys are very resilient. Back at the beginning. That was just a warp backwards. Uh, I could just go straight to Dex, but I'm not going to. I'm going to jack out and come back. I want my uh, stats to ref replenish. so I don't have anything here, right? Yeah. Okay, textures didn't load properly there. Oh, look, my cuff dirty. Shit. Let's go without picking anything, because I think that's what gives you 10 next time. Trying to see what's up here. If I can go anywhere. Well, I mean, I've been up here, but I want to see if there's anything. Oh, look, it is.
Didn't think I'd get anything for that. Good to know where that is, though. Invis chips, always good. Oh, I see there's two portals here. I kept thinking that the jack in port here was just in Den Area 3. Yep, there we go. Multiple chips. Point of this. Why would they build the internet like this? Nice. Yep, 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 This shit, oh my god. Fuck! Relentless. No forgiveness in this fucking game. Of course, I don't have dash attack when I need it. Really? What I need to do. I need to wait for Dash to show up. Phone for a minute. Dash should be here, right? No, of course it isn't. When I needed you the most, you abandoned me. I can't even make that my regular chip. Oh 
man, I'm already getting hungry. That's not good. I've got another three hours of stream left. What am I gonna do? Well, I'm gonna save first off. Remember when ACDC Town used to look like that before Battle Network 4 completely changed it for some reason? Still nothing. Man, you guys just fucking suck, don't ya? Note that I was nowhere near him, and I still took damage from that. I do like that the lighting effects actually affect the environment around me. Like, you can see the blocks above, like, light up with amb ambient glow. That's pretty cool. Also, why is Dex's PC in the global area? How does that make sense? here now. Now I get dash attack when I don't fucking need it. A lot more intimidating if they actually came towards me.
global area too. Oh, I actually have to go through the area. We can get into Dex's PC from this area. That's right. Let's hurry, or Gutsman might not make it. Un or Gutsman might make it out into the net. Mega Man, we can get into Dex's PC from this link. Got it. I wonder if Gutsman's okay. Bye, Bob. You can get to Global Area 3 by going up this cyber ladder. It's like a ladder, but in cyberspace. You can get to Dex's PC by going left, not up that cyber ladder. Hi, Cannon. Nice. But as it stands, kind of useless. One of them isn't going to really help me that much. That's the level 4 security cube. And a mem up. Cool. Twenty-one cannons now. Ah, me guts. Cut it out. Stop it, guts man. Guts man. Hey, Mega Man Land, you showed up. Dex, you gave him a zero virus vaccine, right? Yeah, what about it? What does that have to do with this? We'll talk later. First, we gotta take care of Gutsman. Sorry, I thought I just heard something. Cut it out, Gutsman. Ugh, this is too much fun to stop. If you get in my way, I'll just smash you too. Ugh. He's just like Fireman. He won't listen. What should we do, Lan? What should we do? All we can do is damage him until he calms down. Okay, I'll try. Ready for operation. Got it. Mega Man, battle routine set. Execute. Oh, 
One more hit and I would have been dead. Got a cloud do that with cannons. Oh, what got into me? Gutsman, are you back to normal? Oh, my head hurts. Huh? Uh, destroy. Destroy them. Len, Mega Man. Dad. Dex, you've got to jack Gutsman out immediately and turn off your PET. Yes, sir, Gutsman. Jack out. And he's gone. Whoa. Dad, what are you doing here? How, what are you doing here? How are you here? Are you in the house, or... Did you just, like... Are you just, like, jacked into to his PET somehow? Like, is he video chatting with us? I ran a search for Mega Man, and you got, found you guys here. Glad I made it in time. Hey, Dad. That vaccine really was a fake. Ah, yes. I verified that, too. That vaccine has a nasty Navi hacking effect programmed in it. Anyway, Lan, Mega Man, first you'll have to jack out. Then we'll talk. Okay, Dad. Mega Man, jack out. Got it. Whole lot of jacking going on over here. When Mega when Lan sends Mega Man into the internet, he's literally jacking it with a bro. I'm sorry. If the Navi hacking program hidden in that vaccine activates, it will take control over Navis, and PET commands will stop working. That means Fireman and Gutsman. Dad, isn't there anything we can do? All we can do is damage the Navis to temporarily disable them, and send the Navis back into the PET to sleep. There's no other way. Darn, who wouldn't make such a nasty program? I don't know, but the damage is growing at an alarming rate. It's horrible. Len, listen to me. I have to attend an emergency meeting. It's too dangerous to go. Both of you stay inside today. Len, what are we going to do next? Hmm. There may be nothing I can do now. Yep. But I wonder how you could get infected with the Zero Virus. Aren't you okay if you just avoid opening any suspicious files? Yeah, I guess so. Huh? Len, you just got four emails. Damn, that's a lot of email. Yai. This is an emergency. The system that controls my garden has gone haywire. It's making the plants grow too big. It's caused my gardening machines to move around randomly. They'll ruin all my garden's plants and flower beds. I tried to contact the center, but I can't get through at all. You're the only one who could help me, Lan. Please, you gotta do something. The computer that controls the power supply for the shopping district is out of control, huh? It's short-circuiting all the machines in the district. It'll destroy the shipment of merchandise I ordered from my store, huh? Len, can you help me? Go to the shopping district from the Metro line and do something about that computer. I'll give you a rare chip for it, huh? Wow, it's been a long time since I've sent you email. I wonder if you got this. I'm in the waterworks now. Our water stopped for some reason, so I got on the Metro line to come down here and complain. Apparently the waterworks computer is running amok and they can't fix it. You might have to miss dinner today, so don't be disappointed. Lynn, I need your help. I took the bus to the bank in the town next over. Ne next town over, excuse me. The bank security has gone crazy and I can't get out. I tried to call the center, but I just can't get through to them. I jacked roll in, but the security is too tough and the two of us can't do a thing. I was about to set it up so that you could jack into the bank from outside, however, so please come and help me. Wow, I'm so glad a kid can hack a bank so that you could jack into it from a distance. What's this? Might be because of the Navi hacking program. All right, that's it. Dad said not to go. Dad did say not to go out today, but yeah, we can't just let it get our friends. No way. We'll have to go to Yai's shop, Yai's garden, shopping district via ACDC station, and the bank in the next town over via the bus stop. Those three places. Yeah, and the water works via ACDC station too. Then home in time for dinner. Okay, that's four places. You could decide where to go first. Gotcha. So now we actually get stages. The world's really opening up to us now. Recover 80. See, the problem is chips, single chips aren't that useful now, unless you get, unless you have more of them. Because, like, Recover 80 is great, but that's a one-time thing. Once I use it, I don't have it anymore. That's a whole folder slot I'm using up.
I still haven't gotten a reg up yet. It's still 8 MB. Ugh, excuse me. What is this? It's just like the last like 10 ships I bought or got. And some items too. Ah, uh. oh, jeez. I just pulled my TMJ. Like when you yawn and you feel your muscle, your like the side of your mouth gets hurt, and then you just feel like a sharp numbness in your like at the roof, at the bottom of your mouth. Ah. Ah. Uh. Okay, I'm good. You can enter Cyberworlds from ACDC Station, the bus stop, and Yai's house. Ooh, unlockers. Uh, I can get some of the armor now. We're gonna need the wood armor, definitely. And I believe we're gonna need the aqua armor, too. Oh, they have three more. Spice, Elect Blade, and Heat V. Ghetto. I beat Gutsman with the level of S. Wait, does that mean I got his chip? No, I got Gut Punch. Shit. Yeah, you just get kicked out if that happens. Alright, where to next? Bus stop gets me to two... That's, bus stop gets me to the waterworks. Ba oh, bank. Okay. And then that gets me to shopping and waterworks. Right, let's go to Yai's house first. Mataro! Oh yeah, chirp step. Forgot about this. Lan, you're late. Is that the way you greet me? And I came all this way to help you. Alright, don't worry about it. Yai, what's the situation? I know why the computer is malfunctioning. A Navi? Huh? How'd you know? That's right, exactly. The Navi of the Navi of the guy who came to check my garden's computer, Needleman. You were right, Lan. Yeah, it's that Navi hacking program. Mega Man, you gotta stop Needle Man from ruining this garden. No problem. Wood. The gun. Ah! Sucks. Why would they do this to me? I can't believe this game is out to get me personally. Bomb. 
bubbler. Fire sword, nice. That's where I'm supposed to go. A hoof memory. Oh boy. I totally memorized those hooks. Sword. Wow, we just pile those on here, huh? I gotta admit, for, for a Mega Man game that takes place on the internet, these uh, environments look very nice. A lot of spice. Dominic, you rat. How could you give me the old spicy battle chip? Okay, that's death down there. that one more. Oh boy, Zenny's. Mystery data is locked. Ah, oh, shit. I need an unlocker for that one. I'm about to die. And I died.
Ooh, nice. That's, that should be a drop down. Three way, five. Oh, no, never mind. It's just another three way chip. Uh, that is uh, disappointing. Same spot, too. Oh, yeah, he, re he reminded me of the backups there. Alright, I'm gonna- I'm gonna jack out and come back. Solely because it's better to just keep all the shit you got, because you keep everything you pick up as long as you jack out and save. If I get a game over, though, that's it. It just kicks me back to the title screen. It's a little clunky, but again... Mid-2000s Capcom wasn't exactly the most forgiving with this stuff. Mataro! The nice thing is all the green mystery data's come right back, so you could just pop back in, grab a few, and you're on your way. That's a pretty good sub chip. Uh, as you could probably guess, that instantly fills up your sub ch your cu custom gauge. It's also the only game where it's actually a sub chip instead of a regular chip. Normally, custom a uh, full cust is a chip. Spice in my folder because I'm getting a lot of them. Why do these things hit so hard? God.
at how white knuckle some of this was here. Really? Also, lower recub chips, a little less useful once you get more health. By the way, this is with wood armor on, so I'm taking half damage from wood attacks right now. So, that just goes to show you how much damage the enemies will deal out in this. Spreader. Man up. Nice. we want to add in here. Yeah, see? See if the number's red there? That means I can't hold anymore. Let's go replace shotgun with it. It's not going to help me. Fire sword will probably be useful here. Don't need three-way right now. Oh, I actually got a tree bomb too. Put that in there as well. Fuck it, why not? Let's put the gut punch in there too. What else am I out of right now that I could replace? Nothing really. Yeah, I mean, 100 damage for one punch isn't really worth it when you could do 10, 50, or 14, 50 damages. Also, I just noticed, uh, it actually tells you when you could be using it, uh, on, I guess, moving, uh, jumping, on a ladder, or hanging off a rail. And see, like, spice you can only use while you're on the ground. Stock sound effects. Yeah, <laughs> cut, slice, chop, sharp, sharper. Plant machines move. Make a sharper design for this garden. Cut and slice. Cut it out, needle man. What you? You're gonna try and stop me, huh? Don't try any funny business, or I'll have to stab you. Psha! Hmm. That guy's a mean one, all right. It's because he's gone crazy. But anyway, here he comes. Ah, Mega Man. You gotta stop. You got- Mega Man, you gotta stop. You have to stop. It's time to stop. Battle routine set. Execute. How do I- Oh, I have to press the same button. I like how there's like high quality images of the Navi symbols below their health bars. That's really cool. I've always been big into the Navi symbol idea. Just like having like a cool insignia that represents you. Ah, uh, you guys. What's this? What's going on? Is he back to normal? Maybe. Yai, is Needleman's operator there? He's here. What should he do? His PET's probably working again. Tell him to jack out right away and turn off the power. J jack out. No noise. You did it. The garden's control computers are back to normal. Thanks, Lan. Well, Lan, what a relief to get that over and done with. You got that right. Garden seems okay now. Okay, Mega Man, check out. Gotcha. Love how Lan just buys a figure of each Navi afterwards. Len, you aren't forgetting to upgrade Mega Man, are you? Power-ups are particularly important for upgrading your Mega Buster. Power-ups can be used to improve the Buster's attacking, repeat firing and charging, 
which lets you repeat firing and charging, will let you release a charge shot by holding the button. Could you have given me one? That would have been nice. Burns Fist. Burnsing is a complicated process which we refer to as the Burnsing process. Step 1. The item is chosen to be covered in burns. Step 2. The item is coated in liquid and burns. Thanks to you and Mega Man, my garden management computer is back to normal. Thanks again, but when I look, when I relaxed and took a good look at my garden, I decided that Needleman's design isn't all that bad either. Would have thought. I've included a small token in my appreciation. Nine S nine, God damn. All right, well, got all the armors. No spices. No point in buying them. We should told you how many. Oh, there it goes. Owned. I really want to see what's in that mystery data, but... Man, the spread of, of uh, stuff in this game is annoying. I wish they used words instead of symbols. Next, Waterworks, Shopping District, or the Bank. The Bank is Quick Man, Waterworks is Iceman, and I forget what Shopping is. Who's in the Shopping District? Oh, Higsby. Um, yeah, I forget what that is. Might do Iceman first. That's not right. Music's still playing. This is the second time we've been here. The last time, the World 3 stopped the water supply as part of their plot. Well, uh, that certainly wasn't supposed to happen. Uh, uh-oh. Uh Don't look at that. Uh, well, shit. Did it, did it just glitch, or, or what happened there? Second time we've been here. The last time, the World 3 stopped the water supply as part of their plot. Yeah, they threatened the Waterworks technical consultant, Freud. They made him use his Navi Iceman to stop the water. This reminds me of that time somehow. Really? Well, anyway, we'd better find the computer's problem fast. I don't want to miss dinner, you know. Let's go, Mega Man. Yeah, I don't know what the fuck that was. Didn't fuck with my stream, did it? Hold on. I don't know what the fuck that 
Okay. Let me, real quick. All right, there. I made a uh, a GameCube restore po restore point. Who knew that Nintendo put that shit in their systems way, way back then? They were really ahead of their time. enemy isn't actually in no Battle Network normally. This is an enemy from Battle ne uh, from Mega Man 1 that appears in Iceman stage. Double Needle. Double Needle. Hope memory, oh boy. only appeared in Battle Network 1. What do you get from those? Double jump. Oh. Also, oh, there's no air jump. There's no air shoes. It's just a double jump chip. I think it's the same graphic, though. No, it's not. It's actually a different one. Cool. Well, I know where to come to farm those now. Man, I'll coat everything in ice. And he's gone. Ugh, it's no good. We lost him. Hey, you, Navi, you're from the center? 
Huh? Ah, hello, Freud. Mega Man. Lead. What are you two doing here? Well, you see, never mind that. What's going on with Iceman? Oh, this whole fuss is being caused by Iceman. He's on a rampage. Iceman 2? Freud, did you give Iceman the Zero Virus vaccine? Hmm? Well, yes. Why? The vaccine contains a, ha a Navi hacking program. What? So that's it. Lan, most of the Waterworks Navis have been frozen by Iceman. Iceman's a powerful Navi, but you might have a shot at beating him. I know I have no right to ask you this, but Lan, please stop Iceman. Leave it to us. Ain't that right, Mega Man? You betcha. Let's go stop Iceman. Thank you, Lan. Please hurry, though. Iceman's in there. Yoku time. by that. Okay. They do a double fake out. <sighs> Take a uh, short breather here for a second. Time is it anyway? 1018. Okay, so I still got two hours left. Wow. This isn't a one stream game, definitely not. But we get pretty far. I missed a mystery data. I mystery dated that. Takes so much punishment. Interesting. Land, the waterworks code is kept in the area past the link to the left. Okay, thanks, Freud. Alright, let's gotta come back here. Shit! Just 
trying to see if there's anything to the left. Damn it. Or right, rather. I'm going left. Okay. We've had enough of this. I know, I should have seen that the wall was right there. Uh, okay. All right. Mega Man. Let's just go out. No. Okay. Hitboxes. Mega Man, we have no more backouts. If you run into backouts, if you backups, if you run into trouble, let's jack out. I'm just gonna make a return trip here. I got the code. I think it stays in the key items. Yeah. The waterworks. I'm sorry, the Wut Wook code. I'm jacking out and preparing for another trip in here. now. Oh, I don't have Aqua Sword? That's weird. I thought I did. Oh, whatever. Have it now. So Mem Up is MP Up. 
I still need reg ups to re to increase my regular chip though. The upside is that like you could still get to a point like I like have 21 cannons. That's a lot of firepower to have on hand. Wanted that double jump. Satisfying. And I got that thing's chip. Show this off because I think honestly I'm gonna exit and come back again. <laughs> Actually, no, I won't. Ah! Oh. All right. Well, we gotta make a return trip here later. Bungle that one up. All right, uh, let's go. On here, on here, then here, over here. Wait. Here, here, there. Go. Go. Reg up. Oh man, finally.
perfect. So, just like regular Mega Man Battle Network games, pick three of the right ships in the right order, and you get, uh, program advances. Spice. Put that in there as well. I can feel an advance coming on. Activate. Hell yeah. You only get one of them, but it's, da it's damaging as fuck. Everything must freeze. There he is, Iceman. Mega Man, damage Iceman and make him stop. Okay, Freud? Yes, please do it. All right, let's go, Mega Man. Battle routine set. Execute. That's a pretty decent chunk of damage. I can't get that one, it fell off screen. What? What did I do? Is he back to normal? Freud, you should have control back of your PET temporarily. Jack out now and turn off your- ugh, Jack out now and turn off your PET. Okay, Iceman, jack out now. Yes, sir. How is it, Freud? I'm verifying the status now. Great. The computer's operating normally again. The water will flow as it should now. Thank you, Lan. Woo-hoo! That was a weird way of doing it. Woo-hoo! And there's still time to get home for dinner, too. It always comes down to food with you, Lan, doesn't it? Well, I am a growing boy, you know. All right, Mega Man, jack out. Gotcha. Land, you've got email. What's in Cyberworld? Various data is hidden in Cyberworlds, especially in the net. Recently, there have been reports of mysterious eight-character codes being found, but as of now, no one can say what these codes might mean. So there are a few codes you can un you could find throughout areas of the game. All they are are their, their um, number trader codes for Battle Network 3, which I used when I played through it, so... Finding them is kind of pointless. You use repair in a specific spot, and it makes an, an eight-digit code pop up. Mystery source. Land, thank you. With your help, we were able to repair the waterworks. This must have been the work of a Navi hacking program or some undernet criminal. That reminds me, I found a mysterious source file in a data graveyard near the entrance to the undernet. What could it be? So that's a hint for something a little later in the game. If you don't grab it, uh, you actually don't get a good ending. There's two endings to the game. The bad one and the good one. And that, uh... That hint is supposed to get you towards the good one. Ice Slasher. Ice Cube. Heat Shot. Oh wow, a reg up gives you eight megabytes. Okay, instead of two, like the other games. So now I could put, uh... Swords and dash attacks and stuff as my regular chip. You know what that means? Time to head back to Internet 3 and get that, uh, data missing. While I'm here, I should also, uh, go back to Higsby, or Number Man, rather. Yep, 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 hoop, hoop, hoop. Nice. 
already worth the trip. Custom sub chip. Eh, could be better. Bitch. Get the invis chip. Hold on a second. Uh, actually, no, that's not the time. Nice. Reg up. Perfect. Okay, now is the time. 24 MB. Perfect. Alright, uh, didn't I get an invis at some point? Or did I... I don't understand. What the fuck? What happened? I know I got a chip from that ghost at some point. Wait, is it a stone bod? Is that what I got from him? No, that can't be. Needle cannon. Fires off eight needles. Quad needle. Triple needle. Double needle. I don't know what I got from that ghost. I, I, I have too many st things here for the, to go back that far to. Yep, 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 yep. Really? Okay. Dodge the splash damage there. That way leads to Dex's PC. Whereas this way goes to the... Uh, the dude. Number man. Hey! 
Can I get that? That's what I want to know. I wonder if I can maybe reach that if I get one more, uh, if I have a double jump. Oh, I have two double jumps. Okay, cool. Uh, replace the V-Gun with that. And I can make it a regular chip. Perfect. Banner day for Michael. I might as well wait here until it's ready, though. done. Got a backup chip. So that means now I just permanently have four lives whenever I jack in. Perfect. Sword doesn't reach. Number man, what do you got for me? He's got a power up. I should just. Yep, and I need 8,000 for the next one. Don't have any blowers, or twisters, or tornadoes. Probably come back for all three of those. And we'll get an HP memory. I don't know, I, like, I'm tempted, because the thing is, if you have max attack and rapid, it's way better than waiting for charge shots. At the same time, though, if I put the time into maxing out the charge, I could get them a lot quicker and do damage quicker, so it kind of evens out. Feeling. Just, just want to be safe. I think the problem is that the game was maybe moving too quickly, and it wasn't loading everything fast enough. But I don't know. That could just be, uh, just be my imagination. Anyway, let us alter our folder. I got a ton of bubblers. A lot of V-guns, too. A lot of shotguns, as well. I could put bubbler in. Bub V. Bubbler and Bub V. Oh, 
Alright, where to next? Nine, nine, S. Man, I'm getting close. Scotsman is the only one I beat with an S right away. I wish there was multiple folders in this game, but there isn't. Right, so we got the bank, and we got the shopping center. I forget what the shopping center is. I think that might be Color Man. I'm not sure. No, this isn't Color Man. I think this is Bright Man. This is a Navi unique to this game. So this is the shopping district Cyberworld Higsby mentioned. Testing, testing, huh? Land, can you hear me, huh? Higsby? I'm using an industrial class line from Higsby's to access your location, huh? Land, I figured out the cause of the disturbance, huh? A Navi running amok caused the computers to act up, huh? Thought so. A Navi running amok. Bright man, a shopping navvy from the district store. Ah, I had a stroke there. Bright man, a navvy from one of the shopping district stores suddenly went crazy and took over the computers to use their power on lighting, huh? Higsby, we'll go into the cyber world and find that navvy. Let's go, Mega Man. All right. Please find him, huh? Mega Man, I sent you chip data. Oh, there's just a lone enemy here to fuck you up. God, this music is so good. This soundtrack is amazing. memory, and I knew I was going to get hit right there, too. Wow, not a single one of you wants to drop your chip, huh? There we go. Alright, this area is great for spice, because these enemies are all weak to wood. Fire beats wood, wood beats electricity, electricity beats water, water beats fire. Really? Really? Son of a bitch. I was not expecting that to happen. I better set, uh... Spice is my main ship here. This game's iframes, or lack of iframes, are kind of bullshit.
Better wait for my MB to refill a bit. Ooh, nice. Beautiful. Upgrade rapid. Unfortunately, it does not increase charge time. It's still the same very bad amount it was originally. Mystery data, uh, of course. Why don't I have the elect armor equipped? That's clearly what's in here. Satellite one. QQ lasers. HP memory. And that. Nice. This game's really generous at times. chips though. Life Sword 1. Oh, right, there's a Life Sword 2. You can get Life Sword 2 by using the elemental, uh, chips. Which I think I have all of them now, so I could probably put that in my folder. Nope, I still need, uh, a Lex Sword. Thought I had it already. Oh, I have a Lex Blade, that's it. Yeah, that's why I got confused before, because I have the Blade. So the these three will make Life Sword 2, and these three will make Life Sword 3. Which is, the, which is the money shot, that's the one I definitely want. Wow, look at that luck. <laughs> more light, more! <laughs> uh, what's up with this guy? Well, aren't you pretty rude, aren't you? Show me some manners. I'm Bright Man! A shining man. The most handsome guy in all the cyber worlds. Ha! <laughs> what a vain fool. Mega Man. Bright Man, stop messing with those computers. Stop. But the cyber world is still too dark. I'm just trying to lighten the place up a little. <laughs> Dang, he's gonna short circuit the entire district. Let's stop him, Lan. Alright. Mega Man, battle routine set. Execute. All oh, right. Okay, 
so there is a way around this. I just don't get how. Uh huh. Well, that kind of sucked. How do I hit him? Oh, really? So it is possible to hit him, it's just... like a weird like he's only invincible he's only he only hit him like for a very brief moment yeah this ain't happening Just uh, straight jacking out right now. So that didn't work. Uh, huh. I didn't want to lose, because if I lose, I lose all my progress in that stage, and it's not worth it. Not with all the chips I just got. I can unlock uh, those two mystery datas in the other stages. Let's do that. Sabu chipu geto. Oh, there's a Lec- wait, no, I have a Lec Blade. I need a Lec Sword, and I need a Fire Blade. a little weird that when Mega Man jumps in this game, he starts shaking when he hits his peak. He can't hold that pose.
power up. Oh, that was well worth the time. Well worth the time coming back out here. Just gonna power wrap it up to the max as soon as possible. Oops. Not bad. Oh, fuck. Did the thing again. Why does it do that? Alright, I gotta go back and get that thing again. Fuck! I did anything between then and now, right? Stable game. Might as well have Vinny stream Mario Sunshine and uh, the music would play the first note and then get stuck. But that didn't result in his stream crash, in his game crashing, which is very annoying that that's happening here. You know what? I think that was a good thing because now I get to fix my mistake. I think it's better to pump up charge because once the charge shot is maxed out, that gives me a higher damage uh, quick shot. That then gets even stronger once I upgrade attack.
Oh, now it goes three levels. Now I actually get the full charge shot. See, there we go. I knew that there was a better version of the charge shot. Yeah, that's pretty good. here. It just seems to be completely random. The other one was in the waterworks. Again. is uh, a little unsettling, not gonna lie. A very weird, bubbly noise. Alright, I need the dash attack, so... I'm gonna hold on to that for now. Oh, that ice is absorbing all the spice. here. HP memory. Eh, not the best, but definitely not not worth it. Only raise it by 20? 10 in this game? No, it raises it by 20. Never mind. I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> Alright. Well, I still don't know how to deal with, um. What's his face? Right, man. Maybe I'll go to Quick Man first. Though he's also gonna guard, isn't he? Shit. Sorry, I'm getting paranoid about this this issue now, so I, I'm gonna keep doing that. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Alright, 
let's try uh, the bank. Another good song here. Mail, we just jacked into the bank security system from outside. Lan, thanks for coming. Okay, we're going in to see what we could find out what's causing. Blah. We're going in to see if we could find out what's causing the problem. Thank you so much. We're all still stuck inside the security system, so I'm sure she can help you out in some way. Okay, let's go, Mega Man. Ready. Huh? Who are you? The name's Quick Man. Fastest Navi in the cyber worlds. Fastest! What are you doing here? Hey, are you the one causing all this? I'm zooming all over the system. You wouldn't believe how fun this is. I see. Lan, this guy's running all over the security system. And what's and that's what's causing all the errors that have mail trapped inside. And he's what's causing my game to fu uh, fuck up constantly. He's the one out of control this time, Mega Man. We gotta stop Quick Man. Go ahead and try. If you think you could stop me, go for it. But there's no way you can match my speed. Vroom! He's gone. Man, he's fast. My processes can't keep up with him. Dang. Let's go after him, Mega Man. So this is interesting, because he's a boss in the, in, chronologically in the next game. And yet you're meeting him here. I don't remember if that happens again in this game. I know Shadow Man is in this game, but you also fight him in one, technically. Lex Sword, nice. Got the three. I got the Holy Trinity. There's some fun stuff up there, but I can't get there right now. Roll. Ah, oh, Mega. A Navi just went by here really, really fast. It's Quick Man. I gotta catch him. If you're going down, be careful. There's a bunch of security beams. If you touch one, you'll take a lot of damage. Security beams. This won't be easy. What are you gonna do, Mega Man? If I run through faster than the beams that block the path, I can make it. Okay, I'll operate you. Be careful. Dang it, there was a blue one up there. Reg up. Well, not terrible. Definitely worth getting. Oh yeah, so... Oh shit. So just like regular Quick Man, uh, his sta the stage does have uh, instant kill beams. Fun. Yeah, exactly. Ooh, recover 150. Nice. Kind of causing the game to chug a bit. You 
really don't get any leeway. It's a green mystery data. I'm not missing much. What did I just get from them? Shield guard. Fire blade. Oh, I think that's the last one I was missing of that, too. Sword, swords, fire sword. Yeah, it was. What do you know? Oh. There we go. And I can make all the life swords. And use them all exactly once. If I actually get them all at once. Nice, and that takes effect immediately, so I have two lives now. Good. So five lives total. Four fuck around and find out lives, and then one, uh, one I'm dead life. So please get the fuck out of there. Again, just in case I forget. I don't want, I don't want to have something happen and then the game freezes again. At this point, I'm not sure what I can trust anymore. Wait, Mega Man, there are a bunch of security beams up ahead. Yeah, I feel them. It gets more dangerous up ahead. The differently colored ground is safe. Until you reach the other side, whatever you do, don't stop. Okay. Okay, well, what have we learned today? Are his feet always vulnerable? They are. Yes, we know. Meg we know Lan, Lan, Man, Mega Lan. There's an unlocker over there. Okay, I gotta come back for that one. There's a laser beam that comes from the right there. And I fucked up. It's so weird that Long Sword uses the same image as Aqua Sword and Fire Sword, but then Electric Sword is an image of Mega Man, but not the Elect Blade image. It's a bit weird. In Battle Network 6, it's funny because Longsword actually has a different graphic in Battle Networks 5 and 4 and 5. 
that looks more like the wide sword and regular sword, but then in 6 they change it back to this one. Just because of nostalgic purposes, because they knew 6 was the last game. Anyway. We are absolutely not uh, taking the chance here. from him. I bought everything I can. I don't have a lot of Zenny actually right now. I could try to go back to Number Man, but he's not going to give me a whole lot. Not with my current uh, amount of money. I think the next power-up's what, 8,000? So I'm not getting that anytime soon. Also, the swords and the blades... Oh, right, the blades go horizontally while the swords go vertically. Yet, these are considered lower rank, even though they have more damage. Sometimes things just don't load. It's really weird. Yes, we know. God. Damn it. wrong with me. through it. I'm gonna die at some point anyway here.
Okay, we got it this time. We should get to see a little further down. Fuck! And that was the right way, too, because the laser shoots out from the other direction. At this point, it's not even worth it. I only have one life left anyway. Did I get anything on this trip? No, because I died at the same spot. Might as well just take the game over at this point. Death by laser. Yep, still have all the blades in here. I literally just saved. Uh... What time is 11.30? I could still go for a bit more. But do I want to? I kind of want to stop, but at the same time, maybe I should keep going for a little while longer. Let me see if I can maybe clear out those two uh, stages. I was gonna say, did it change my my starting one? But I didn't set one, I guess. That happened. I guess all those trips to the uh, waterworks. No, 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 do not. Shit, I don't like this. I remember this being hard, but I don't remember this being like this this level of crap right going on right now. This really does feel like a uh, an unwinnable situation. Oh, 
I ah ah man, I do not believe myself. I cannot believe myself. Yeah, yeah, we know. It'd be nice if they gave you like a few more seconds to come to, to like figure things out here. Is that green or blue? I can't tell. It looks like green. Actually, literally cannot tell. green. What a complete waste of my time. Oh god. X C D wait what? Extra code hint. The last place you first went to, repair from high up. Oh, uh, that's the third game. That's the third area. That's a code to get one of the codes. A hint to get one of the codes for Battle Network 3. while that while those both bars refill <laughs> I don't want to enter with no MP they really should just let the MP they should just let it all max out when you enter a new area honestly just to make it a little easier and also because you could just wait by the portal for it to fill up anyway A lot of hits here, huh? I can't believe you followed me this far. Why don't you just give up already? No way, I'm still not fast enough. If you're planning on getting in my way, then I'll get rid of you here. <laughs> Heard that before. Mega Man, battle routine set. Execute. Sorry. Ow. Shit, man. I mean, again, I didn't get anything this, this playthrough, so if I fuck up now, whatever.
What hit me? Really? Really though? That was cool. What the fuck, man? Alright, how do I beat either of them then? That sucked. Alright. Time to, uh, look it up. wiki page that's gonna implant my screen with with a half so half screen video that I can't close Jesus when did the internet become so bad like when did this become the norm for the internet sitting here now. Wow. Just keep shooting him. Just don't get hit, forehead. Whatever. Suffer. Pain. Suffer. why they would put two bosses with counters like right next to each other because that's definitely not the norm for this game and both of these bosses can do it
Is that the middle one or wait? Yeah, it's far right now. I did that way quicker. this, and then cannons. Life Sword 2, 300 damage. Not bad. Okay, now I remember the Chi strat. Now I just wait until the bar fills up. That way I could use the program advance and immediately pull up the custom menu again. Also, that program advance does not use a lot of data. It only uses eight. Day. heals now, of course. Oh, that fucked me. If it was one... Mm -hmm. ah! Well, so much for the easy way. One hit left. Ah, oh, fuck me. I guess we're bubbling. But you're supposed to. Yeah, you're supposed to do that. One hit away. Cool. Oh, look at this. This spread is terrible. Oh, man. That was cool. That was real cool. Is he able to hit me like that? Why? Why? It was one hit away. You gotta be kidding me. What's the deal with that? Fuck. This is bullshit. Oh my god. Three times in a row I get him down to one hit. That's such a load. Oh my god. Come on!
okay. Well, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Yeah, that was cool. Sure love doing this level over and over again. is a very delicate balance of bullshit and more bullshit. So cool. So glad that happened. Lighting didn't load properly here. You can see the enemies are all shadowy for some reason. HP memory. Getting through this level isn't as much bullshit as it was before. Fuck 
squad, you're going down this time. Okay. Alright, not even close. We didn't even get close to this as we did last time, so clearly that didn't work. Uh, oh cool, and I finally get healing, but now I only get 10 cannon shots to win. That's neat. So I have a choice. I can either go in, or I can wait for another 5 to come up. I was I was feeling good and now I'm not. Yep. Yep. How he moves so quickly. I'm d okay. I'm shooting him and then I'm firing. It should be hitting the barrier and then hitting him. It's not working for some reason. It just like fucking f fizzles out into nothing. God, stop hitting me, please. I'm begging you, you gotta stop. Oh, he canceled my chip! He canceled my chip! Look how he canceled my chip! This is bullshit, oh my god. How did I ever beat this as a kid? Absolute shit, dude. He's one of the easiest bosses in two, two, which is which makes this even funnier. Uh, uh, what have I been doing? Quick, man, your jack out command. Okay. He jacked out. This one's operator's been monitoring him. Probably, but anyway, the system should be back to normal. Lan. Mail, how are things over there? We're okay. The security system let us go. Alright, that was almost too easy. Man, you sure are proud of yourself, aren't you, Lan? Well, why not? Okay, Mega Man, time to jack out. Gotcha. Fuck that stage. I am never going back there. Unless I need that stupid Quake chip. Thanks for your help, Lan. You're awesome. You're the greatest. You're, you can do it. And all the commo commotion, I forgot to withdraw my money. I kind of want to go back near the bank for a while, if you know what I mean. Oh, I got another roll chip. Cool. Nice to meet you. I'm Quickman's operator. Thanks for stopping Quickman's rampage. I have to stay hidden, but I'd still like to thank you. Please accept this small gift in return for your help. Fast gauge. It's funny, because his, his operator is like one of the first villains you fight in 2. And he's like a stuck-up snob who, who thinks he's important because he has a high IQ. So he's a Rick and Morty fan, essentially. 
Oh, good lord. to go on another shopping spree yet, so that's out of the question. So apparently Brightman isn't too bad. The, the, the trick with him is to shoot above him first, and then shoot him with something. Keep the elect armor on. <sighs> so I'm hitting almost four hours here, and I gotta stop soon, but maybe I could get to this last stage and defeat Bright Man. And then we'll pick it up uh, after a GDQ. Mag bomb there. Is on the wall, even though I know it's not. Yes. Oh, I didn't go the way. Out. I didn't go the other way again. Oh, there's also a locked mystery date over there. Shit. Well, whatever. This is a much easier stage to get back to. Really wish my jump command had worked, but whatever. Oh, it's just over here. I could just walk this way to get it. I should have bought an unlocker, though. That annoys me. Maybe that'll be what, if I finish this next boss quick. Maybe that'll be what I do to wrap this up. Wide. Grab this, grab this, 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 and that. No, not that, that. Nope, didn't get in there either. 
Oh, that didn't get him. Okay, that didn't work. Alright, I'm waiting too long. Nope. No, that's... Uh, this is ridiculous. Oh, I got him there with the, the piss shot. Okay. nice to know like when he's dropping his guard rather than he drops it and then immediately it comes back up like some sort of visual cue saying like okay my guards drop now would be cool but I don't think I'm getting that I think that's a little too much from for uh, me to expect out of this nope that didn't hit him that didn't hit him there we go. So it's like right before he drops the guard. Too early. Too early. There we go. One Zenny. Well, whatever, I beat it. I'm feeling if I let my guard down here, it's the thing's gonna happen, so let's not. Huh? What was I doing? Ugh. Wow, he sure calmed down in a hurry. Like a light bulb going out. Lan, are you okay, huh? Higsby, that Navi's PET should be working again, so tell the operator. Jack out Brightman and turn off the PET's power. Okay, huh? Jacking out. Whew. Nice work, huh? The computers are back to normal, huh? Alright, Lynn. Everything looks fine now. Okay, time to jack out. <laughs> I wonder what Higsby's gonna give us, hmm? Lynn's an asshole who always expects something for his hard work. Whew, what a relief! Now all we gotta do is wait for Dad to make the real vaccine. Land, dinner. Alright, Mom. Wonder what's for dessert today. Ah. Uh, what's wrong, Mega Man? Huh? Well, maybe it's because I've been active for so long. I feel... slow. That's alright. You've done enough for one day. I'll see you tomorrow. Alright. Good night, Lan. <laughs> Everything's going according to plan, right? Oh, it's you, Starman. According to plan or not, it's none of your business anyway. Like a human unaware of his own breath, you spread the virus by living. What are you trying to say? Hmph, just verifying things. Lately you've been searching for info about outside Cyberworld without telling me. And to do what? You're cursed. Have you already forgotten what you were born to do? I haven't forgotten. I am to generate the Zero Virus. Spread the darkness. The reason I was born is... Probably not the right voice for him. Good morning, Lan. How'd you sleep? Yo, Mega Man, it sounds like you're feeling much better. Hey, it's a phone call from Dad. Did you make the vaccine? Lan, you're awake already? Yeah, of course, Dad. Uh, Dad, have you been working all night again? 
Ah, yes, it's been going rough. It'll take a bit longer to develop it. Really? It's that tough? Yes, the Navi hacking program is very closely linked to the Zero Virus. Since we have almost no info about the Zero Virus, there's little we can do. The officials are even offering a reward for info about the Zero Virus. Wow, a reward? We should go look for clues, too. Forget about it. What the- Chod! Sorry to interrupt, but as an official, I have to state this clearly. Lan, as an ordinary civilian and as a child, no less, your independent actions are frankly a nuisance. Kodoman and I will handle this. What are you talking about? You're a kid, too. <laughs> don't pretend you're in the same league as me. That's right, Mr. Chod is Mr. Chod, excuse me, what happened to Lord Chod? Has prevented a number of national-level crimes. Proto Man. You're not the only one. We defeated the Life Virus and wiped out the World 3. And you're still a little punk. Do you really think you did that all alone? And the World 3's plans have simply taken a different form. What? Heh. <laughs> anyway, just mind your own business. Goodbye, Dr. Hikari. What's up? Uh, what's up with him? Just because he's an official net battler, he has to brag. Um, maybe? Huh. Aw, uh, Lin, I have to get back to my research. I'll contact you again, so stay out of trouble. He hung up. Dang, now even Dad is treating us like kids. Mega Man, we can't give up now. Yeah, we need to cure Gutsman and the rest of them fast. Okay, let's look for information about the Zero Virus 2. Let's get that reward first and show Chaud a thing or two. Lan, thank you for your help. Thanks to you, the disturbance didn't affect me very much at all, huh? I'm sending you this on behalf of the, all the inhabitants of the shopping district, huh? Thank you for shopping at Higsby's, huh? Barrier chip. Let's collect chips. Special chip collection. Are you trying to collect battle chips? If you keep meeting a powerful enemy that you can't defeat, jack out and go back to places you've been before to collect useful chips. But be careful, you can only carry a certain amount of each. If your folder shows a red number for a chip you can't carry anymore... Yo, Lan, I just heard a really strange rumor. It's about the arcade in the next town over that you can get to by bus. Some nasty Navi has invaded the game chassis cyber world. The rumor is that this Navi has something to do with the World 3. The World 3 might be up to something again. Be careful. You know the abandoned power plant where you could get to the, on the metro line from ACDC station? Deep inside that plant's cyber world is the zero virus data, is, is where the zero virus data is supposedly. The center is offering a reward, so why don't you check it out? Good luck. From your biggest fan. That's not ominous. Wait, never count- oh, because I got a game over. Never counted Life Sword 2. I'll get both of those and maybe, uh, get that locked mystery data and then I'll finish up. Two. That took so long. Yeah. How much HP does he have? 500. If I get Life Sword 3 and hit him once, that should be enough to kill him. Oh, he sells full energy now. Plenish all your HPs. Every single one of those HPs. MP charge. Gradually replenishes MP to the maximum. What? Is that a sub chip? Oh, it's a sub chip. Okay. Why is it gradual? MP already recovers gradually. It should just be charges your MP immediately. Oh, he sells barrier now, which I already have because he gave me one. And cold punch. Taking the risk. I already have almost half the chips in the game. Oh, we're going back to the. No, we're not going to the bank. Fuck that. We're going to the, uh, what is it? the shopping district. There we go. Good job, Michael. You got it eventually.
I should probably use the satellite chips because I got so many of them. to go to the short way to get there because otherwise I'm going to miss it. memory, of course. Well, whatever. Won't turn down more chances to fuck up. I don't think there's anything up there, honestly. Oh yeah, once you've beaten a stage, uh, you can't refight the boss from here, it just jacks you out. Don't bug. Okay. I'm trying to think if like I could get that last power up. No, well, let me go see. Honestly, I might just grind off stream for it anyway. Actually, I should probably stop real soon. I just realized it's 12.20 already. Alright, let me get to the shop, check it out, and then I'll uh, stop from there. Oh, 
you don't throw that very high when you're on the rail. Oh, I'm not supposed to be in this area yet, that's why. Wow. Outer net, that's where I was supposed to go. Outer net, under net, over net, internet. See, I always thought outer net made more sense with, uh, like it being like a dark part of the net, just because it's out in. But you have under net, which I guess also sounds pretty cool. Attack sucks. Already went up there, that's where the backup is. Yeah, power up is 8,000 Zenny. I could get mem ups and HP ups though. Oh, I can buy these as well. memory, and a mem up. Alright, so I need 16, I need 1400 zenny to get the rest of this stuff here. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna buy another recover 80 as well. Alright, so I need, no, I need 1400, or 14,000 zenny to buy everything here. Probably grind that off stream and then buy all that. There's probably still more too after that. But now we have, uh, 380 HP, 120 MP, 5 lives, all the armor, and our buster's already halfway to max here. Not bad. So I'm level 36. Plenty more power-ups to go. And uh, we have a couple sub-chips which I haven't used yet. And we are currently at 66 out of 137 chips. With one PA and two more that I could do right now. PAs in this game aren't that hard to do because there's only one of each chip. It's just a matter of getting all three of them, three to five at once. Anyway, uh, aside from some frustrations in that final hour there, this was pretty good. I'm enjoying returning to this, and I'm probably going to finish this before I go back to uh, Dark Dawn in a week. Uh, but that's going to be it for tonight. Uh, thank you all for coming. I am going to be gone from streaming from tomorrow until the following Sunday. Uh, again, I'm going to be hosting at AGDQ on Friday. Friday morning from 5 a.m. to 7.30 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Check the uh, website for more details. It's gonna the time will change as certain runs go long or short. Uh, I'll be hosting four games in particular, or four runs in particular, and uh, it's gonna be good. It's gonna be my first time doing it, and I'm kind of anxious, but also very much looking forward to it. Uh, so I hope you'll tune in, or at least that the, if it's it, since it's very early in the morning, I hope you'll watch it later on a VOD or the YouTube upload. I'm sure I will be archiving them and sharing them once they go up. And, uh, yeah. I'm gonna finally take a nice little, uh, little break from streaming for a little while. And then once I'm done, once the event's done, I'll come back. More of this, more Dark Dawn, and then... Probably something new afterwards that I haven't played before, which will hopefully be the focus going forward for the rest of the year. Uh, outside of, you know, Battle Network 6. But yeah, thank you for coming. Y'all have a great evening. And I will see you... If you don't see me on Friday morning, uh, I will see you all next Sunday. Later.